Due to its healing properties, potatoes are widely used in natural medicine. Its nutritional and beneficial content for health includes proteins whose quality and quantity are comparable to those of rice and wet, vitamins, for example, the B complex and vitamin C, as well as beta carotene, which is converted to vitamin A in the body. Minerals, including phosphorus, chlorine, sulfur, magnesium, selenium, iron, and potassium. Complex carbohydrates, which are a natural energy source. Phenolic compounds with broad antioxidant effects and dietary fibers of important digestive benefits. Potatoes have therapeutic qualities in the following cases. Gastritis. Raw potatoes are alkaline, which helps detoxify the digestive system and heal gastritis and stomach ulcers, as well as relieve inflammation and pain. Uric acid or gout. Regular consumption of raw potato water helps decrease pain caused by gout. If this liquid is mixed with a little honey, it will eliminate excess uric acid more quickly. Blood circulation and cholesterol. A large number of phytochemical compounds have been identified in potatoes. Many of these are flavonoids, which help protect against cardiovascular disease by lowering cholesterol levels in keeping arteries free of fat. Blood pressure. Potato cucumines help reduce blood pressure, where chlorogenic acid also participates, which acts as a natural diuretic. Digestion, constipation, hemorrhoids, and colon cancer. Potatoes with skin, boiled or steamed, promote healthy digestion and regular bowel movements, as well as exert a protective effect against hemorrhoids and colon cancer. About 50% of the weight of the potato skin is made up of dietary fibers, consisting mainly of polysaccharides. Stress. Potatoes are rich in vitamin B6, necessary for cell renewal, so it helps to have a healthy nervous system and a balanced mood. Anemia. Potatoes provide a large amount of folic acid and iron, so they are very good in the prevention and treatment of anemia. Headaches. Regular consumption of raw potato water help relieve headaches. Kidney stones. Potato tea can help eliminate kidney stones, especially due to its diuretic effect. Liver detox. Potato tea relieves gallbladder problems and improves the liver's ability to remove waste products and toxins. Inflammation, arthritis, and joint pain. Potatoes are a great option to treat arthritis and rheumatism due to the various minerals and organic salts they contain. Burns and skin irritations caused by external factors. The raw potato helps to cure eczema, dark circles, dry skin, and skin spots, since it hydrates and reduces inflammation. Likewise, it helps to produce collagen and elastin, which favors the renewal of cells and prevents some signs of aging, rejuvenating and anti-carcinogenic, due to its high content of phenols with antioxidant action. Diabetes. Cold potatoes help control blood sugar as they favor insulin sensitivity. Defenses. Potatoes contain quercetin, carotenoids, anthocyanins, chlorogenic acid, and caffeic acids, which contribute to maintaining a good immune system. And energy. Potatoes are an essential source of 100% natural energy for the body. When the potato is eaten hot, the body quickly digests the starch, but if it's eaten cold, the digestibility of the starch is reduced. Now let's see how the recipes are prepared. Raw potato water is recommended in cases of gastritis, uric acid, constipation, inflammation, arthritis, joint pain, kidney stones, and headache. For its preparation are required, three medium raw potatoes and two cups of warm water equivalent to 500 milliliters. The potatoes are peeled, mashed, mixed in the water and left to rest overnight. The next day, the preparation is strained and a cup is taken 30 minutes before breakfast and a cup 30 minutes before dinner. On the other hand, potato tea helps reduce inflammation, detoxify the liver and eliminate kidney stones. The required ingredients are 3 whole potatoes unpeeled in 600 milliliters of water. To prepare this formula, wash the potatoes and boil them in water. Once they are well cooked, turn off the heat and the preparation is allowed to cool. 
it's recommended to drink a cup in the morning and another in the afternoon. The resulting cooked potatoes can be used as food in the preferred cooking recipe. Now, in problems of arterial hypertension, digestion, constipation, hemorrhoids, stress, anemia, headaches, inflammation, arthritis, joint pain, diabetes, low defenses, and weakness due to lack of energy, it's recommended to eat steamed potatoes with peel. Its preparation is simple. Simply wash the potatoes and steam them. It's recommended to eat at least two potatoes per day. Finally, for dark circles, burns, and skin irritations due to external factors, the potato is used as a poultice. For its preparation, the potato is cut with its peel and it's applied directly in the form of a slice to the area of the skin to be treated. The effect is faster if it's placed in the freezer for half an hour before applying it. To consume potatoes with total health safety, special attention must be paid to two aspects that they don't have green areas and that they don't have sprouts. Sometimes green areas can be observed on the surface of the potatoes. This is due to the presence of solanine, a toxic and bitter substance found in and below the peel. Thus, discarding the skin of green potatoes reduces the amount of solanine by 80% and no longer possesses a high health risk, and the problem is further reduced by also removing the green parts of the potato pulp. The consumption of potatoes with green areas can cause gastrointestinal symptoms such as diarrhea, stomach pain, vomiting, and fever. In very exceptional cases, when consumption has been clearly excessive, more serious clinical pictures can occur with drops in blood pressure, fainting, loss of consciousness, and even cognitive alterations. On the other hand, potatoes that are beginning to germinate and have sprouts are not recommended since solanine is also concentrated in them. The appearance of sprouts reveals that the starch is already beginning to be transformed into sugars so that the potato will taste sweeter and what is more delicate, if it's subjected to high temperatures during cooking, it will transform into acrylamide, which is a recognized carcinogen. This means that its habitual consumption in these conditions can increase the risk of cancer. <laughs>